Hey there puzzlers, my name is Flip, and today I want to show you an amazing puzzle box by the legendary puzzle designer Jean-Claude Constantine. It's called the 20 cent box. It's a little bit difficult to see on the camera, but there's actually a small coin inside the box. You can hear it as we shake it around. There's a little slot in the top, and there's a hole in the upper right. You also have this mysterious key. There's a little keyhole here where it could go in, but it doesn't seem to do much. And other than that, your goal is to open the box. It's a puzzle with a wonderfully unique trick to it. At first I thought I had to try to get the coin out through this slot, and it might be some sort of dexterity puzzle where I insert the key and try to get the coin exactly to line up, but actually the box does open. And the reason the slot is there is for something after you solve the puzzle. When you first start doing mechanical puzzles, you'll start to hear the same names over again. Will Strebus, Go Pit Kiam, Hirokazu Iwasawa. But one name that you'll hear everywhere is Jean-Claude Constantine. He's made hundreds of puzzles over the years. And this is a very good example of one of his puzzles. It has a central idea to it. A single trick that allows you to open this box. But that trick is really, really good. Let's get started. The key thing I wanted to focus on was this upper right hand corner. There's, it's just big enough so that you can fit part of the key inside, but you can't do much with it. You can't pull out the lid, although it moves it around a little bit. You can't reach all the way down, uh, and this, this blocks it from going any further. And then there's the case of the strange coin inside. Why is this the 20 cent box? Why do you need that particular coin? After trying this for a long time, I eventually hit upon the idea of using the coin together with the key. So tilting the box sideways, puts the coin right under the hole. I tried to insert the key and do something like move it around and see if I could push a lever or something like that. Eventually I wondered, what if the point of the coin was to give me a way to put pressure on the bottom? And all I had to do was press down. Sure enough, as you can see, that takes the bottom off of the puzzle. The bottom is held on by two magnets, each one just strong enough to hold it in place so that you can't pull it off, but weak enough that a gentle push down with the key brings the bottom off of the box. And the reason this slot is here is in case you forgot to put the coin back in when you reassembled the puzzle. Without that slot, the puzzle would be unopenable. Overall. I think this is a wonderful little puzzle that had me scratching my head for a little bit. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe below. Thank you very much for watching everyone, and happy puzzling!